Hi everyone! My name is Jennifer. My name is Eva. My name is Elijah. And my name is Brendan. So today we're gonna talk about diffraction. What is diffraction of wave? Diffraction of wave is the spreading of waves when the waves propagate through a slit of a barrier. The first characteristic of waves is wavelength. There are no changes caused by the wavelength. This is because the, the wave speed does not change. So the next characteristic of wave is the frequency. So during the, fre during the diffraction of the wave, the frequency of the wave will not change. It is because there is no other source of frequency. The third characteristic of wave is speed. There are no change caused by diffraction because there is no change in medium before and after the diffraction. In terms of amplitude, the diffraction decreases. This is because the waves spread, divert, and spread out to a wider region like this. So the last characteristic of the wave, which is the direction of propagation, the direction of the wave will move from one direction to many directions. This is because the wave front of the wave spread during the diffraction of the wave. As you can see here, in the pattern of the wave, you can see that the direction of the wave it, it, it moves to from one direction to many directions because the wave the wave front of the wave is spreading less, spread like that. As you can see here. So the effect of diffraction can be divided into two, which is fixed wavelength and fixed size of slit. Fixed wavelength can be divided into two, which is narrow slit size and wide slit size. Wide slit size is spreading of wave is less significant. Narrow slit size is uh, spreading of wave is more significant. The second one is fixed size of slit can be divided into two which is short wavelength and long wavelength. Short wavelength, the spreading of wave is less significant. Long wavelength, the spreading of wave is more significant. That is all for our presentation today. Thank you for lending us your ears. Bye bye.